Sunbelt, but last year was your first full year into the Sunbelt. How has that helped you coming into this year? I think there's no doubt that us playing Division One competition, we, we made that decision. We could have played FCS competition because that's what we were, but we wanted to play uh, Division One competition knowing we're going to Sunbelt this year. You know, we took our lumps last year, and, and um, but you know, we played Arkansas State within seven points and Middle Tennessee within eight and all that. But bottom line, we're going to be more prepared uh, this year because of going through that schedule. You've been the father of this program. You've seen it grow. You've seen it, I, I, I guess, get up on its knees and crawl. Are you, are you walking? <laughs> are you jogging? What are you doing? <laughs> I, I kind of liken it to we're driving to California. We're probably in Texas somewhere right now. We've got a long ways to go. We've gone a good ways, but we got a long way to go for sure. Uh, our guys want to make the – we have some guys that are fifth-year seniors at this point, and they really want to leave their mark on this program, and that's a great challenge for them this year to, to, to have a season that, 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 and gain respect around the league. I think that uh, we've gained some last year because we played a lot of teams very close and, you know, had a win in some belt and did some good things. But, you know, but bottom line is you got to get wins to, to really earn respect. Yeah, I think so. I, there's, we have some older guys on defense, and, um, you know, and I think that ne even this this year will be even better defensively. We recruited some good guys to come in, and but our offense has worked hard. There's no doubt that if we can get better offensively and move up the ladder statistically, offense scoring points. I think we'll, we'll uh, definitely have a better chance to win some ball games. You got a guy from Alabama that's going to help you. Freddie Roach. Mm -hmm. Seen some old tape of him. He was a beast at Alabama. What's he going to do? Freddie's done a great job uh, in the recruiting area, number one. Number two, he has a great rapport with the players. Uh, works them hard, uh, loves on them, um, and, and, and they respect him because of where he's been. So he's been a great addition to our program. I've heard it said that teams have to learn how to win. How do you help this team learn how to win? you got to do it. Bottom line is this, I, I've been through a lot of games and I've been through a lot of seasons. I think that, uh, you know, we, we preach and work at it. We're preaching, concentrating on your goals. We're preaching so many things then from the tangible, tangible standpoint. But, you know, you got to win some of those close games. I think in, our, in my opinion this year, for us to have what I call a successful season, we're going to have to win about three games that that are close. Uh, last year we probably lost three or four games that were close. You know, if we can win those games, that's going to, to me, put us over the edge. And that's, that's kind of what our goal is to get in those tight games and, and learn how to win them.